In this video, you will learn how to change the row height in Microsoft Excel. Currently, you can see here, I am interested to change the row height of third row. Select this one. I will explain two easy methods. In first method, I will explain how to change the row height when you have exact value about the dimension of that particular row. And in second method, I will explain how to change the row height when you don't have exact value. So in first method, we have exact value. If this video is helpful for you, then please like this video and subscribe our channel for more informative videos. Firstly, select the row. For example, I am interested to change the height of this third row. After doing that, place your cursor here, right click, and here you will find the option of row height. Select this one, and you can enter the values. For example, I have values of 60. I will write 60. After that, click on OK. And you can see here the height of rows is changed now. Similarly, you can also repeat these steps for multiple rows as well. For example, I want to change the height of row 1, 2 and 3. I have selected all these three rows, right click. Now you will find the option of row height. Click on this option. And here I will write values. I will write 60. After that, click on OK. And you can see here the height of all these three rows is changed now. So you can use this method for single row as well as multiple rows. Now I will explain second method that is applicable when you don't have exact dimension of the rows. For example, I want to change the height of these third rows and I don't have exact dimension or exact value. So for that purpose, firstly select that row and place your cursor here. Now you can see here plus sign appear with double arrow. Now you can move it upward direction or in downward direction and in a text box you can see here the dimension is also appeared. Similarly, if I move it into downward direction then you can see here the height is increased and if I move it in upward direction the height will decrease. So by doing so you can easily adjust the height of that particular row. That's the end of this video. Thanks for watching this video. Goodbye.